friends, so I had started my live telling about my new Oracle deck, Beautiful Spirit Cats. It's the artistry is amazing. So um, you can check out my live that I did. Um, I'll link it in the description below so you can see my review of this. But then my friend, Dangerous Size Tarot, she had to go live. So I was like, well, let me get off my live so you can be live because we got each other's back like that. So I said I would do the other uh, oracle that I got, which is the Spirit Animal Oracle. I would just upload my review of it, and I am in love with it. It's by Colette Baron reed She is a respected spiritual intuitive psychic medium educator and oracle expert. And the artistry is amazing. It's a huge guidebook too. Look at the size of that. So let's flip through. This is like a very large oracle. There's how many... How many cards? There's like a lot of cards. I don't know. But there's a lot. Let's see. Maybe it's on the box. And the box is so nice. Oh my goodness. So look. It's like a very nice. Yeah. 68 oracle cards. And they are so beautiful. Look how nice that box is. So, this is the back of the card, which is absolutely glorious. It's got like a matte feel. I love it. I just want to pet the cards. Pet the cards. <laughs> you wish you could touch them. <laughs> um, but they're beautiful. Everyone who knows me knows I love working with animal energy and my magic. And I love my animal spirit um, the Wild Unknown Oracle Deck by Kim Kranz. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. And my Stephen D. Farmer, um, it's the Power Animals. I have the book, the hardback book, and the Oracle Deck that goes with it, which I didn't know they had until I just randomly saw it and had to get it. So, um, I love working with animals, and um, I like having various options available to me um, to get different perspectives on different animal energies and everything. So, of course, I wanted to add more animal spirit oracles to my repertoire, and my husband doesn't understand why I need them, but I need them, I need them, especially the cats. Um, because animals are like my magic. So, of course, I need all the stuff for my magic. Um, but I'm on bed rest, or supposed to be, because of my sprained ankle. And so, my husband checks the mail now. And he sees all my online purchases. Oops. Anyway. Oh, well. He has his bank account. I have mine. As long as the bills get paid... We don't have to ask any questions. I don't ask him about all his motorcycle parts and everything. But his thing is, the motorcycle is something we both enjoy because I ride with him. He doesn't really get to partake in my awesome witchiness. He's such a muggle. He's so mundane. But the artistry of this deck is so beautiful. Look, Elena, my friend Elena, she loves giraffes. Look at that beautiful giraffe, giraffe spirit. It says, see the big picture. And I'm sure there's just so much more information in the guidebook. We'll look at that later. But I wanna look at some different cards. Like, and this one has so many, like 68 cards. Look at that. Like, so it has more random things. And I love that it's not just animals, it's insects too. We got the grasshopper spirit. He's the king. Look at that pretty Mandela behind. Oh, pretty. So the grasshopper says, take a leap of faith. See, we can learn so much from animal energy. So much. Oh, look, it's a groundhog. Time to let go. Eat your heart out. <laughs> mm. I love the artistry. This deck was made for me like the artist she doesn't know she made it for me but I am the person that she made this deck for 
many others can buy it, but it's for me. <laughs> this speaks to my soul. So this is the frog spirit, and it says, clear out the clutter. Holy crap. Okay, I am putting this on my altar because the clutter in my house, like I am not a motivated witch. It's crazy, and I really need to do a spring cleaning, but I have no motivation. Until, of course, today, when I'm supposed to be on bed rest, I'm like, ooh, I want a clean house, which never happens, but of course I can't because of my ankle. <laughs> I think it's all psychosomatic. It's all in my head. Like, the only reason I want to clean house is because I know I can't. <laughs> yeah, me. Oh my gosh, I gotta do some shadow work, y'all. But this card, it's going on my altar. Yep. Clear out the clutter with the frog spirit. Alright, so now we have the hawk spirit. Let spirit be your guide. And I love, like, in the background, look at all the, like, I don't think you can really see the beauty of this card. Like, you just have to buy this deck and see it in person. You will not be sorry. I will put the link in the description below because you need this in your life. You need it. You just have to have it. Just tell your husband, tell your wives, tell your mom and dad. Sorry, gotta have it. Horse spirit, freedom is yours. Oh, it's so beautiful. It's so funny, you guys. Like, when I first started my mm, witchy path, <laughs> for lack of better terminology. Um, I was like, why would you need more than one tarot deck? Why would you even need an oracle deck? Okay, if you need an oracle deck, why would you need more than one? And like, I don't even know how many <laughs> oracle decks I have. And I think I have like three tarot and so many oracle. Like, it's so addictive, you guys. It's like eating up Pringles or getting tattoos. <laughs> which is funny because my husband was walking by the other day and he was like, I forget how many tattoos you have because I have the cat semicolon on my foot. And I'm not going to show you because it's all wrapped up and everything. But um, <laughs> he was like, I forgot you had that tattoo. So yeah, I might have an addictive personality. More shadow work to be done. So tattoos, Pringles, and beautiful oracle and tarot cards must have them. Fox spirit, think on your feet. I would love to, but my foot's out of commission. <laughs> uh, bed rest for f four days now has made me crazy. <laughs> um, a little delirious. Oh, pretty. Flamingo spirit, embrace the in-between. Oh, yeah. The in-between, liminal, the hedge. <laughs> and I guess flamingos can step over the hedge because they're so tall. I don't know. Whatever. I'm crazy, y'all. <laughs> and I'm not even on pain medicine. <laughs> Ooh, the elephant spirit. Learn from the past. And I love how, like, you've got the beautiful mandelas in the back. But all the animals, even the grasshopper had a crown. Like, all the animals are adorned with beautiful jewels and war paint or bohemian spirit, sacred paint. It's beautiful. Oh, the hummingbird. Be here now. Ramdas, be here now. Beautiful colors. So Ramdas, um, his like foundation, he has like an app. It's the Be Here Now app that you can get on your phone. If I can, I'm, I'll link it below, but look it up and get it. Like there's all kinds of like great quotes and affirmations and um, like I think even interviews and stuff. The Be Here Now Ramdas Foundation app. Look at the beautiful koala, koala spirit. It says, spirit has a plan. Cute. I mean, look at the little bell. Look at everything. Look at the detail. The detail of this deck is absolutely amazing, you guys. Koi fish spirit. There is always enough. This is so pretty. 
So yeah, I had a little extra money, so I was able to order these two decks. Um, because my birthday was March seventh, and my husband never gets me a present. He always just cooks for me. Um, which food is nice, but you know I like presents, so I got my own present. I am a self-sufficient, empowered woman. I don't need no man. Lion spirit. Be generous of spirit. I am. I'm generous to myself. I spoil myself. Because someone's got to do it. <laughs> Lizard spirit. Dream the world into being. Every, every single card has a beautiful Mandela in the background. Oh my goodness, I love it. This deck is really, really gorgeous. It's very bohemian. It feels very spiritual. I have to sneeze. I'm warning you. I always sneeze like three times. Really hard. I'm going to go over here. <coughs> One more. <coughs> huh. I just feel like this time it's only going to be two sneezes. But I usually think sneeze in threes so like all my friends and family know they don't tell me bless you until after the third sneeze but this time I'm done only two like my mom growing up because I was I would always sneeze in threes and I don't know if it's like an old wives tale or what but she would always say that if you sneeze three times you're a witch well, I sneeze three times every time. Oh, and then she always said that, like, witches would always have, like, a beauty mark somewhere on their right side. And me and my mom both had beauty marks. I had mine removed um, on our chest right here. And um, then I read later that um, all women have some kind of freckle or mole or beauty mark on their right hand. And so, like, I notice, like, so many women do. Now, I've met a couple women who just don't. But, like, s most women do actually have. And they say that's a sign of a witch. You know, probably from back in the, the witch hunting days. I mean, you were a witch for any reason. But, I mean, there's things like that that are so interesting. Really. So, check it out. See which women in your life have the mark on their right hand. It's pretty interesting. I don't know how I got off on that tangent. But, this is the moth spirit. Surrender now. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Um, if I go through every card, we'd be here all day. So let me, <laughs> let me just, um, tend to the small things. Mouse spirit. I forget I'm not live and I can't just ramble. I'm going to have to like upload this two hours of me just rambling. <laughs> Nightingale spirit. The crown. The Mandela. I'm going to have to really study like the symbology in this deck like okay every card has a mandela most cards have um some kind of crown or some kind of adornment on the animal oh look the otters you are never alone and there's two of them okay you guys you know otters hold hands when they sleep on the water so they don't lose their loved one you're never alone oh my god that's so precious otters who loves the freak out of some otters? Raise your hand. Otters are amazing. They're amazing. Okay. Sadie. Owl spirit. My friend Sadie loves the owls. You can see clearly now the rain is gone. Ooh, the panther spirit. Oh, look how mystical she looks. Reclaim your power. All right, I'm going to speed it up. Speed it up. Parrot spirit, watch your words. I usually watch my words as they're flowing out of my mouth. And I just watch them affect the people around me. I'm like, oops. No, not really. I'm a perfect lady. Peacock, let it shine. Oh, yeah. Did y'all watch, um, oh, what was it? The Masked Singer? 
<laughs> the peacock. I was convinced the peacock was, um, oh, what's his name? The, the guy from the doctor show and, like, I don't know how I met your mother. Uh, Patrick Hare? Patrick? Harris. Anyway, I was convinced that's who it was, but I was wrong. Me and my husband had such an ongoing debate about that show. It was so shocking. Pig spirit, use your mind wisely. And look, of course the pig has wings. Pigs fly. I have collected pigs since, like, pig figurines and toys and stuff since I was, like, two or three years old. So this one is definitely going on my altar right now because that is glorious. Beautiful. Okay, uh, Porcupine Spirit, time for Beginner Mind. I'll have to read some more about that. That's pretty. I'm so excited. I ordered from my girl, Amanda, at Down South Taxidermy and Oddities. Um, I made a video about unboxing some stuff from her. She's the one I got the big bones from. Um, Down South Taxidermy and Oddities. She has some, like, um, vials of porcupine quills that you can buy. And then she has also, like, single, um, African porcupine quills that are, like, huge that you can buy. Um, so I got those, and she's gonna ship them out day after tomorrow. And I also got a skunk pelt, because if y'all seen my other videos, y'all know that the skunk is, like, my power animal sending me a lesson in life, like, right now. And the skunk energy has really helped me get through, like, some stuff with work and everything. Um, so anyway, that's exciting. I got a skunk coming. It's like a wall hanging pelt. And I got some porcupine quills coming. So I'm pretty excited. You can do all kinds of warding and protection stuff with that. And also skunks are for warding, of course. <laughs> you can ward people off. So that's good. What is that? What is this? It's an electric eel. <laughs> what Oracle deck has an electric eel? This one, because it's freaking awesome. Bring your ideas to life. Oh, yeah. Look how pretty. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, I gotta speed it up. Eagle spirit, the eagle has your back. I love this deck, you guys. Dragonfly spirit, truth transcends illusion. Oh, yeah. All right, speeding up, speeding up. The dove, be peace. I am peace, and I'm also crazy. Uh, dolphin spirit, this and that are true. <laughs> I can't wait to, wait to read more about that. This and that are true. It's all true. It's all good. It's all the same. We're all one. <laughs> Your truth is my truth. Oh, look. Oh, God, you guys, it's a puppy. <gasps> look at a puppy. Dog spirit, be loyal to what you love. Yes, look at a puppy. Oh my god, dogs are the most loyal things ever. Dear spirit, bring a gentle touch. Oh, she's beautiful. I should put her up by my do uh, doe skull. So pretty. Like, I want to, like, use these, like, in my life daily. I don't want to have them in the box just waiting to do a reading. Like, I want them around my house for purposes. For stuff, man. For stuff. Crow spirit. Co-create with spirit. That's beautiful. Yeah, and these cards are so pretty. Like, in my live I was doing about the spirit cat oracle like the artistry is so pretty like i want a deck to use and then i want one to like make collages and stuff with rabbit spirit now is a lucky time and the rabbit has leaf wings <laughs> i love the imagination of this deck like it's it's superb it's transcendental rhino spirit <laughs> overcome any obstacle just bust through it with your nose y'all <laughs> be the rhino. <sighs> I'm really happy. Like, life is good. I just like being crazy and enjoying life. And I love that I've gotten to the point in my life where I can just do that. <laughs> yep, it's great. Okay, Sandpiper Spirit. Be playful. Some kind of bird. Sandpiper. 
I'll have to look that up. I love this deck because it has the more obscure random animals. It's so great. So great. Scarab Beetle Spirit. Magic works through you. Oh, my girl Amanda at Down South Taxidermy and Oddities. I think she has some scarabs. I know she has butterflies. Taxidermy. Um, I need to get me a scarab just because they're cool. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe. Why not? I think now I'm beginning to be an oddities collector. Like, it was like with the skulls and everything because I use them in witchcraft, like the animal energy. I bond with the energy of the animal and utilize their energy and their spirit um, as they allow me to. And, um, but then, like, it just started, like, you can't really be into taxidermy if you're not into, like, the whole of oddities. And I've always loved Ripley's Believe It or Not. It has been on my bucket list. I want to go to every single Ripley's Believe It or Not museum in the world. I would love that. My husband isn't really into that stuff, though, so I need a friend to go with me. My husband is such a muggle. I love him. It's a good thing he's cute. He's really cute. Yeah, I got lucky. I am lucky. Seahorse. Watch and wait. Skunk! It's my skunk! Oh, God, he's so cute! Oh, she's got a little mask on. Oh, she's pretty. It says, know your worth. Look. Pretty little skunk. Snake spirit, time to heal. <whistles> Snake. S Spider spirit, oh, she's beautiful. And her web is adorned. Make your dreams real. She is beautiful. I love spiders. They're so beautiful. They're so magical. I had a tarantula. Her name was Ursula. But um, I gave her to my coven sister. And I miss her. But I know she's being taken good care of. Squirrel spirit. Believe in yourself. <laughs> yeah. Oh, she cute. Alright. Stag spirit. This is on the box. Take the lead. Oh, she's so pretty. And down south, taxidermy and oddities. She has a beautiful antler. Um, she's made like a, a bohemian, like dream catcher with the f beautiful feathers and stuff and flowers. I want it so much. I'm going to save up and get it unless you beat me to it. <laughs> Starfish spirit, open to infinite possibility. Pretty. All right. Ooh, Swan Spirit. Time for a deep dive. She is glamorous. I said I wasn't going to go through every card, but here I am 23 minutes and 19 seconds later going through every card. Turkey Spirit. Give with gratitude and grace. But when I'm on a roll, I'm on a roll. So I'm having fun. Are you? I hope you are. Turtle Spirit. Slow and steady wins the race. If you're not having fun, you don't have to stick around. There's plenty of other videos to watch on To Be Land. So have at it. But if you're still here and you love every single card I'm showing you, thanks for sticking around. Vulture Spirit. Nothing is wasted. That is cool. That's a good one. Wasp Spirit. Oh, like I love all of creation, but wasps are some bitches. Like, they are mean, they are aggressive, and they will just, like, bees, if you leave them alone, they'll leave you alone. No, a wasp will hunt your ass down, just because he can. Sometimes life stings. But every animal has its place. Every being has its worth and value and purpose. Well, spirit, trust the great mystery. That's a good one. White Raven. Oh my gosh. So have y'all seen that meme thing? Like saying that like white ravens are not really rare. It's just that like the albino is. Sorry my eye itches. It's just that like their mom like 
or their like flock doesn't like they kill them because they're different and isn't that horrible so like white raven trust in the magic that's so sad all right wolf spirit oh this thing in my eye won't quit i'm sorry like as soon as i get on a video and start doing stuff like my body decides to like flip out i'll start sneezing coughing eye itching just it's horrible wolf spirit turn knowledge into wisdom i love the wolf like ever since meeting the wolf as my power animal like I close my eyes always and I see my magical symbol every time I close my eyes. Um, but now, since meeting the wolf as my power animal, behind my magical symbol is the wolf spirit there every time I close my eyes. Do y'all do that? Do y'all have things? Like, I went through a phase as a teenager um because i'm from new mexico and you know roswell and the aliens and everything so i went through a phase where i was like obsessed with aliens and like i would close my eyes and like alien faces would be there like every time like i'd be in the shower trying to wash my hair with my eyes closed and aliens are like attacking me you know um i don't know maybe i'm just weird like that i'm really being open and honest with y'all here today Hmm. But, like, I hope I'm not the only one. Do y'all, like, have reoccurring things that every time you close your eyes, it's there? Let me know in the description or in the comments. Tell me. Tell me I'm not alone. Tell me I'm not the only freak. Wombat spirit, be at home. <laughs> it's so cute. The little elementary school where I met my husband in fourth grade when we were 10 their uh mascot is the wombat and i'm like what even is a wombat anyway random knowledge ant spirit time to collaborate yeah all right this is almost 30 minutes long i gotta speed it up antelope life is speeding up i remember when i lived out in new mexico in uh, West Texas, they had antelope just running out. You could see them wild. Armadillo, too. Set healthy boundaries. He's cute. Uh, badger spirit. Badgers are so mean. Be fearless and bold. <laughs> Look at him trying to be cute. <laughs> he knows he's a grumpy old curmudgeon. <laughs> That's great. Bat spirit. Oh, cute. Rebirth is assured. All right, beaver spirit, lay a solid foundation. Pretty. Hey, Briggs, what you doing? Oh, bee spirit, look. It's the gears. He's like a steampunk bee. How cool is that? Bee says, sweet results await. Bobcat spirit, life is a mystery. He's pretty. He doesn't really have a lot of adornment. He is just majestic and fabulous as is. I woke up like this. <laughs> oh, the brown bear spirit. Take time out. Look at his paw. Look, the painted paw. He's got his war paint on. He's glorious. I love him. Buffalo spirit. Like, I did a video on buffalo spirit, but, like, I think I wanted to go more in depth. So I might have to do that again. The abundant universe will provide. <laughs> uh, butterfly spirit. Ooh, transformation is beautiful. So look, it's the big butterfly with all the little baby butterflies. That's cool. It's a unique card. Really pretty. And the butterfly is its own adornment. The canary spirit. Sing your own song. Look at the music. He's wearing his little crown. Cool. And he's on like a like a flute, like some kind of musical instrument. That's cool. Cat spirit, claim your independence. Beautiful. 29 minutes I've been going. I gotta wrap this up. Chameleon spirit. That's so cool. Cow spirit. The miracles are endless. I love cows with flower crowns. Cows, cows are beautiful. They're beautiful. And the last one, coyote spirit. Trust in divine detours. 
that is good okay guys if you stung around if oh my gosh if you stuck around for this whole 30 minute video um you're awesome and thank you but also what are you doing with your life <laughs> anyway you guys i love you i highly recommend this deck it is glorious as you can see it is beautiful um so buy it i will put the link for you to purchase these two glorious decks in the description below and I love you and blessed be and happy day goodbye